I'm meteorologist Peter Chan at the National Weather Service for Alaska statewide weather on this Saturday afternoon, March 11th. Well, a cold front is working its way gradually southeastward from areas of the North Slope along the Brooks Range into the Seward Peninsula. This feature will press southeastward and weaken. It is the leading edge of colder air. There will be a stronger secondary system drop in out of the Arctic Ocean and eastern Russia that will provide a stronger reinforcing shot of cold air, especially along the west coast into the southwest portion of the state early in the week ahead. In the meantime, though, uh, we still have winter weather advisories for some light accumulating snow and blowing snow for St. Lawrence Island and the western part of the Seward Peninsula, including Wales uh, down through uh, Teller. And farther south and east, we still have some strong gusty outflow winds along areas of the Panhandle, though they have come down from what they were on Friday and overnight. In fact, uh, Juneau area uh, late Friday night had a gust up to 76 miles an hour down at the docks. But again, winds are expected to continue to recede there along the uh, areas of the Panhandle as high pressure over northwest Canada will not be quite as strong uh, going into early next week. As I mentioned earlier though, we are going to see a trend towards some colder air working its way uh, southeastward across the mainland bringing below normal temperatures across much of the state here for the upcoming week into next weekend. Of note, there's been increased earthquake activity on Tanaga Island, which is west of Adak in the western Aleutians. Tanaga and uh, Takawanga volcanoes with this increased earthquake activity has the interest of observers and uh, scientists monitoring uh, the earthquakes there in the Aleutian chain because that could be a precursor to an eruption. So the Alaska Aviation Weather Unit of the National Weather Service, as well as the U.S. Geologic Survey and the Alaska Volcano Observatory will be keeping a close eye on the volcanoes there of Tanaga Island. And a final note to pass on, time change coming up this Saturday night, early Sunday morning, spring ahead one hour, or stay up and watch your cell phone clock flip there at 2 a.m. to 3 a.m. For Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Peter Chan.